Let's go to Chapter 09 of Baruto, 2 Blue Vortex, complete and narrated. So loading. Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, and before the content of this video, don't forget to leave your like, subscribe to the channel, and activate the bell. This way, you won't miss anything. So, let's get to the video. Chapter 09 of Baruto has arrived here on the channel, complete and narrated. On the colored cover of the chapter, we see Team 10 with Ino, Chocho, and Shikadai. Already on page 1, we have her Sarada. Page 2. The chapter begins right where Chapter 08 left off, with the encounter between Team 10 and Himawari and the Shinjus, Hidari, and Jura. Shikadai says, this is Shikadai from Team 10. I've made contact with two intruders. Sasuke's whereabouts are unknown. Urgently requesting reinforcements. So, in the still confused looks of Jura. Shikadai continues. What's your business here, are you looking for something? Then, Jura looks at them, grabs a book, and says, I remember you, as I thought. Nara Shikadai, belonging to the 10th squad led by Kazama Tsuri Moegi, son of the Hokage. Page 3. Then we see tension in Shikadai's eyes, who says, What does this mean? Do you want me to pass a message to the old man? Jura then responds, Unfortunately, I have business with my predecessor. I came here following Naruto Uzumaki's leads. To be honest, we were surprised too. Then Inijin says, There's no way the 7th Hokage is here, right? He, he hasn't appeared in 3 years. Shikadai finishes. Hey! Stop talking nonsense. Then Jura responds. I understand, at least we know he's not in this village, the QB's responses are just what I can sense from here. Page 4. All of Team 10 is speechless at what they heard. Inijin says, QB. Chocho also says. What's up with this guy, he's talking non-stop. His appearance, the hairstyle too. He's definitely dangerous. Shikadai says, what's going on here, how is Himawari related to QB? Then Jura says. Who knows, I don't understand it very well either. This is a truly mysterious world. One question after another keeps coming up. Pages 5, 6, and 7. Then, with a cold look at the children, Jura says. However. This is a good thing. Then Jura's attack begins, from the ground up to near Himawari, we see a trunk growing. It starts to envelop Naruto's daughter. At the same time, Inijin says, Himawari-chan. Meanwhile, Shikadai begins to use his shadow jutsu. He uses it to prevent the tree from completely enveloping Himawari. While Inijin draws what seems to be a toad from his scroll. Page 8. The rescue action continues, with Shikadai's shadow completely locking the trunk and the toad's tongue enveloping and pulling Himawari from there. Chocho completes the rescue by grabbing Himawari in her arms. Chocho says she's free. Inijin runs saying. Himachan. Jura praises Team 10's action saying, this coordination was incredible. They did all this without exchanging a single word among themselves. Uh. Page 9. Jura continues. I'll respect the teamwork and offer advice. Our only goal is Uzumaki Himawari. I have no hostility towards you three, however. Shikadai looks sweating coldly. Jura continues. If you intend to resist, I'll have no choice but to attack. Then, Shikadai hears a voice. Shikadai. Shikadai responds. Dad? It's Shikamaru who says. Are you okay? What kind of situation is this? Page 10. Shikadai responds. The enemy's objective is Himawari. I don't know why. But it has something to do with the QB. Shikamaru is shocked, but what? Scared and in thoughts, Himawari says, but what is your intention with me? Page 11. The scene changes, we see Kawaki who is unconscious. Someone says. Just a moment. What is this? We see it's Amato who is watching the scene on a monitor. He says. Wait a moment. 
What's the deal with this guy? Pages 12 and 13. Once again the scene changes, now we see Baruto and Kashin Koji. They are apparently in Orochimaru's hideout. While Baruto looks at his karma, Kashin Koji says, Baruto they're moving. Then we see a toad which is seeing the bodies of the two shinobis killed at the beginning of the Shinju's invasion. Baruto then says, what is this? In Konoha? Kashin Koji says yes. Hurry to Mount Mayaboku. Page 14. As we see Baruto preparing the teleportation jutsu. The scene goes back to Team 10, Shikadai says. Tell me something. You came here following a lead about Naruto, that's what you said, right? With the attentive looks of Jura, Shikadai, and now with Shikamaru's attention, he continues the question, and now you're focused on Hima, why? Then, Jura responds. Let's be honest here, the lead is the QB itself, because I can feel this chakra reaction coming from Uzumaki Himawari. Shikadai in thoughts, what does he mean by that? Why Himawari, the QB doesn't exist anymore. Page 15. Himawari speaking softly says, QB. Chakra. Chocho says, stay calm Himawari. This must be a mistake. These guys got their target wrong. Jura says, as I said before, we are also shocked, why it came to this. I want to know too. Uzumaki Himawari, by devouring you, I'll get my answer. Pages 16 and 17. With tension in their looks, Shikadai says, if you eat that. Jura says, I warned everyone. Ino Shika Chocho. Shikamaru says, the current location is in the northwest of the district, hurry up. Then a voice says, behind you, Shikamaru, don't look back. It's a toad saying, just connect me with Ino on the mountain. Baruto entered Kanoha. Page 18. The scene changes, now we see Kawaki and Delta. Delta says, you finally woke up. Don't make me worried like that. You don't want to show yourself to Aida-chan, do you? Kawaki says, don't shout in my ear, if it's damaged, it'll recover. Delta says, just because you have nearly invincible regeneration doesn't mean you can be reckless. Delta continues, they're in the outskirts of District D now, let's go. Kawaki says, wait. There's a person, show yourself unwanted guest. Pages 19 and 20. The scene changes, we see Baruto already in Kanoha, on top of a roof while looking at those dead shinobi. Baruto says, this is definitely with style. It must be them. Then a voice starts talking to Baruto. Hey Baruto, can you hear me? We're on an unofficial call like last time. Baruto responds. Yes, I can hear you. Shikamaru continues. Two Shinju enemies you mentioned appeared. Apparently came after Naruto, but for some reason, their new target is Himawari. It seems that Kyuubi's chakra is related to her, do you know anything about it? Baruto is shocked and says. What Kyuubi? We see that Kashin Koji was also astonished by the information. Pages 21 and 22. Then someone arrives where Baruto is, it's Kawaki and Delta. Kawaki says, sensory team, this is Kawaki. Confirming the intruder is Baruto, who should have been suppressing his chakra. He is where the Hunin were killed. Baruto then looks back. Kawaki says. Why are you hiding Baruto? Aren't we friends? Both monsters. Baruto then says, 8th Lord, wait for me a bit, Kawaki found me. Shikamaru says, what? Baruto says, you're the only one fooling around here Kawaki, especially when Kanoha is under attack. Kawaki says, you don't see yourself, do you Baruto, you're also an enemy of Kanoha. Baruto responds, enough of this nonsense, we should deal with them first. Then you can come to me. Kawaki says, are you mocking me? Pages 23, 24, 25, 26. Then the action starts. Kawaki uses his dojutsu to shoot spikes at Baruto who easily dodges them. Kawaki and Delta are surprised at the moment while Baruto calmly approaches Kawaki. Kawaki keeps the offensive by shooting more spikes. But Baruto easily dodges again. Then Kawaki uses his giant hand and throws himself at Baruto to hit him. But Baruto calmly punches Kawaki in the stomach, making him fall. Page 26, 27, 28, 29. 
Delta is shocked. While Baruto approaches Kawaki, she says, Wait. Baruto then says, Kawaki that was pathetic, you seem not to have trained properly in this time. Delta looks at Baruto sweating cold. She says, How much did this guy train? Then with a cold look from Kawaki, he starts activating the karma. Baruto instantly seems worried. And his karma also starts activating in resonance. Then we see the toad on Baruto's collar. He says, It's resonating. That's bad. He continues. Baruto, let's go now. Stay away or you'll lose control. Then Baruto flies away from the scene. Delta looks frightened and says, So suddenly. Pages 30, 31, 32, 33. After a last scene showing the karma taking over Kawaki who says, This guy. The scene shifts back to Team 10 again. We see Inogen rescuing Himawari, both on top of a bird. Then Shikadai uses his shadow jutsu to paralyze Jura. Shikadai says, don't get distracted, because we're your opponents here. Jura says calmly. This is so absurd. Then we see that from Jura's eye Abijadama begins to form. At the same time Shikadai is shocked to see this, but Chocho appears attacking Jura holding him with a giant hand. The Baijadama then explodes, we see the explosion in the distance, and then Chocho and Shikadai falling to the ground. Pages 34 and 35. In the midst of the explosion, we see that Sarada and Samayar are running towards it. Let's hurry, the Kanoichas say. Sarada in thought says, stay safe Himawari-chan. Shikadai on the ground says, quick Inogen, me and Chocho. Then the bird goes towards them. Inogen says, Himawari hold on tight there. Pages 36 and 37. Hidari, who is calmly with his hands in his pockets, says, we should flee, right? Jura says, Himawari is the target, Uzumaki. If she's delivered, everything will be resolved, although they know it, they continue to resist. Hidari then says, fools, they must have little intelligence. Jura then says, wrong, to resist, something must be driving them to act by their own survival instinct. What do you think it is? That would be crucial information for us too. Shikata then says, for now, I'll keep Hima by my side. The attack missed and didn't come flying. If we stick together like this, we'll see where they come from. Inogen then says, anyway, isn't it better to stay away from Kanoha? Shikadai says, you're right, just keep guiding them like this. Himawari then thinks for a moment and then says, Inogen, please, leave me somewhere suitable. Just me and escape. Inogen then says, hey, what did you say? No, I can't. Shikadai says, you can't escape alone, you don't understand. Himawari says, because we're in this together. Facing someone like that. Page 38, 39, 40. Himawari says, because if this continues, other people will. Then we see Himawari in a strange place. It looks like a wet place. Shikadai says. Hey. Hima. Himawari says. Here. Then someone says, my god, I never expected the guy from the Ten Tails to be a tracker like this. Then on the last page, we see it's a small QB who says. Hey little one. Do you know who I am? Himawari says, the QB right? End of the chapter. Chapter 09 ends showing this small QB inside Himawari's body. That was Chapter 09 of Baruto 2 Blue Vortex. If you liked the video, leave your like, subscribe to the channel, and activate the bell. Until next time and thanks.